Hey, what's going on, tribe? It's Red again. Just hitting you guys up with another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. So, guys, basically, the last few weeks, I've been literally going for it, should I say. Um, it feels like a dark night of the soul, man. Like, there's a lot of stuff coming to be healed and released. But what's interesting is it feels like that transition period is kind of over. Um, which makes sense. You know, like... When you're in it, then you've got the middle ground and then you come out of it. It feels like I'm kind of out of it, should I say. But one thing I've realised is um, when you're doing shadow work um, and healing and stuff, um, it's traumatic, in it? So it has an effect on the body and the body doesn't um, run as it should run um, because it's like slowed down. You need to kind of slow down and heal and process stuff. Um, the body processes stuff different than the mind, yeah? Um, so when you're um, going through um, a healing period or shadow work or trauma coming up or things that are just coming up that are uncomfortable, um, just slow right down and just let it work through it. L let it work through your body or whatever and try not to get too attached to it. But um, so I've been doing that. And um, what I've noticed that the last, uh, since Friday actually, um, no, it's a big shift since Friday. Or maybe it's there to do with the energy of the planet or just energy, um, stuff that's going on, just energies. Or something shifted anyway, within me. Um, where is, yeah, something, sorry. <laughs> something shifted, right? Um, and what I've really just come to realize is that um, when you're doing your shadow work, or yeah, we just call it shadow work when you're just doing, when stuff's coming up for healed, yeah? Um, when you're doing shadow work, we can tend to forget um, our practices and things we enjoy. Um, and we just feel like we're in a hole, right? But um, it can, can, can really suck. But what I realized is the things that you practice when you're doing your shadow work, it only increases when you come back to self if that makes sense like when you come back to yourself once you no sorry wrong word once you've integrated should i say so um during the my shadow period that i was just in um i was doing like a lot of self-care self-love um practicing boundaries meditating i was doing qigong and stuff um and now that I'm shifted out of that space, it's like that is all more enhanced, should I say. Um, like, I want to do it more. And it's like kind of a part of my routine now. And um, so now self-care is um, it's like, oh yeah, if it don't feel right for me, then I'm not going to do it. Because I've got to make myself priority, if that makes sense. Like, um, putting yourself first and stuff instead of others, to a certain degree. Not like a narcissist, but... Actually, no, we're not going to use that. No, scrap that because we're not labeling shit anyway. Um, but yeah, it's about putting yourself first. And once your cup is full, then you can share the overflow is what's going on. Um, which is interesting. Um, Hi. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Just bumped into people. Um, so yeah, once your, um, your, once your cup is full, then you can share the overflow. Um, because that's what I've realised on this journey that I've been trying to kind of save people not save people assist people yeah we call it save people um, yeah saving like helping others while you're drowning do you know what I'm saying so now it's time to change that energy around and to um, help self first make yourself priority and then once you're decent in a good place or whatever then you can help others then you're more you've got more Granted, and your foundations are good because, like in the Matrix, <laughs> the foundations have been built on shit and lies. So, um, you're, we're going to see all that fall away. So, d this is why I feel that we're going through this healing and inner work to set good, strong, positive foundations, and then we can rebuild off of that if that makes sense. Um, but everything's starting to fall into place. Like, I don't know, the energy shifted. Um, so wherever you're at in your journey, you, you, everyone's going to be experiencing different things. So 
you may have some that are still doing shadow work and still heal. The healing journey doesn't ever stop, right? But, um, well, I don't know. For now, it just feels like I'm, I'm getting a breather because it's been intense the last few months, man, to be fair. Yeah, it's been quite rough. Um, so, yeah, I'm getting a little breathing period. But, yeah, once this energy does fully shift and that, it's going to be so... Like, I'm feeling lighter and energetic and I'm kind, kind of buzzing, should I say. Um, and, yeah, I had a nice experience with my nan yesterday as well. So the loving energy is starting to come in as well, man, which is very interesting. Um, cause yeah, the, 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 we want to be working from our heart center and like love is the highest, um, frequency in the universe. So you want to be trying to vibrate at that. Um, but yeah, it's just interesting. It's interesting to see how things are going and things are shaping because the 3D realm is literally falling apart. It's collapsing and we're watching it collapse while we're in a way um collapsing with it to then rebuild because obviously the the ego will is or is or will be attached to certain things in the matrix so it's about trying to step back from that and not get too attached and come back to self because that's all we're trying to do is really come back to back to self really is the main thing um but it's not easy it's not easy the journey is very challenging and it's damn difficult at times um but yeah we just we're all in this together man and everyone's going to be at different stages in the journey different things going to be coming up everyone's trauma and life experience is different so don't um judge people and wherever you're at um, be grateful that you're where you're ever you're at because there's people out there that would switch their problems for your problems man for real so um yeah gratitude gratitude will take you a long way um because that's what's kind of got me through the last last few months definitely definitely the last few months i've always been practicing gratitude recently the last few years but the more i'm grateful for the more it multiplies like literally the last few months like i've been finding money i've been finding stuff and things have just been going smooth even though i've been going through my shit inside externally everything has just been running completely smooth um so yeah things yeah we're getting there the end yeah we're getting there we're getting there collectively um we're not there yet but um soon you'll start feeling the energy shifts and noticing the shifts externally man um because like I said before, <laughs> we we are expressions of God, yeah? And currently, we are consciousness becoming aware that we are consciousness. So there is only one, if that makes sense. So weird. Um, but whatever you're doing for others, you're actually doing for self, yeah? Um, so yeah, it's just interesting. Isn't it? But yeah, it was only a little quick video just to... Um, just to talk about um the things that you practice um more like your the daily if the sorry the more things that you get in practice with like your spiritual practices meditating breath work yoga tai chi qigong whatever brings you to center and brings you inner peace um do more of that when you're going through good times and bad times because the, when you practice it in the bad times you'll only enhance and get better in the good times if that makes sense so like, like for instance if you're having it can be really rough look at doing self-care when you're going through it i know what i know what you mean yeah it can be really rough but if you practice self-care when you're going through it when you come out on the other side this your love yourself even more and the self-care will be even better than what it was before you was in it if that makes sense it's so interesting man so funny um but yeah i'm gonna hit you guys up soon um, with another video because this was just only a little quick one it just popped into mind so i thought oh yeah let me share it with you guys anyway but peace love and luck tribe and i'm gonna hit you guys up real soon